Hi YouTube, it's Sandy. And today I'm going to be doing the handbag for every occasion tag. Um, now I was not tagged in this video, but um, it's one that I was very interested in. I've been watching a lot of uh, ladies that have taken place, uh, taken part in this particular tag and have found it, <coughs> excuse me, very, very interesting. Um, to see different perspectives and how people use their handbags and how people may use them in different ways. For some people, it may be in the casual category and others, it may be more in a, a different category. So that has just been very interesting to me to watch. And so I decided that I also wanted to participate in this tag. So uh, this tag has six categories. One is work, one is casual, evening, minimalist, day to night, and travel. So let's start with the work category. So for work, I have two bags. And for most of these categories, I have two because it was just too hard to decide which one to use. Um, so the first one that I wanted to show is this Valentino bag. This one is really, really good for work because it's so large. And if you're carrying like a laptop and, you know, um, you know, your personal items, if you have files, things like that, this bag can carry a lot of things. And it also has a shoulder strap on it as well. So I would have to say this Valentino bag is a very good functional work purse if you need a large bag to carry. But my true work bag <clears throat> that I carry more often is this uh, Petite Shopping Tote. That's a Chanel Caviar bag. I've had this bag since the 1990s. This is one of the first luxury handbags that I bought, and I've always kept it. It is caviar leather. It is in very good shape, even though I have used it to death. The only um, issue with this bag, if you can see here, is that the shape has kind of gone out down in the bottom here. But other than that, she is in perfect condition and I carry it all the time. This is like my grab bag whenever, you know, so I have this all the time. And even like on Sunday morning when I'm getting ready for church, Many times, if I've carried this throughout the week, I don't even change purses. It just it just goes with me wherever. So this is my petite shopping tote um, by Chanel. So those are my two work bags. For casual, now I want to put a little spin on this. So I'm going to use uh, the category casual slash fun. <laughs> so for a casual bag, it would have to be my trusted speedy bag. And this one has um, been in my collection for a very long time. I've had this one since um, probably like 10 or 15 years or so. You can see it's all wrinkled. I need to put some stuffing in it. But that's my Louis Vuitton uh, Speedy Bag. That used to be a work purse for many, many years. But now I just grab it for a casual. And then for fun, I would have to say my uh, Cult Gaia bamboo bag. I just think this is so cute. And this is a bag that, uh, well, I just got this one, but back in my younger day, I had this exact same bag. And I just thought that it was really cute. I carried it a lot when I was young. <laughs> and then when I saw it in a magazine that it was back out, I'm like, I have to have one of those. And it's, it's been sold out everywhere. So I was uh, fortunate enough to get this bag back in my collection. And I am going to style it with little casual things, um, which will be, um, you know, just to go out for a little casual evening or whatever. I would definitely be using this bag. And check me out on my Instagram. It's Sandy Jacks, S A N D I J A X X, on Instagram. And when I do style this, I will be um, posting pictures with it. So that's for my fun bag. The next one is an evening bag. Now, this is another one that I'm going to say is a. Um, I'm going to use this in multiple ways. So this is my YSL uh, wallet on a chain. And you can 
you know, put the strap on the inside and make it more of a small clutch, which I would carry as an evening bag. Or, you know, obviously you can take the chain out and wear it um, oops, oops, oops. cross body or as a shoulder bag or whatever. But this is a really cute bag that I think really could go for casual and um, for dress because I, I wear it for casual just as a, a regular crossbody bag. So that's one I would say evening slash minimalist. And then while I'm on the minimalist, I will go with my Valentino crossbody bag. This is a casual bag. I use this if I'm going shopping. It gets, you know, a lot of things in it. My glasses, my wallet, you know, things like that. And I just wear it crossbody. It's very functional, very comfortable. But that also will fit into the minimalist category. Then we are into day to night. And so for my day to night bag, I would have to say my, oh, I have the, the felt in here. But this is my um, favorite handbag that I have. And this is my Chanel Jumbo Double Flap in Caviar Leather with the Ruthenium Hardware. Um, so this is the bag that I would say goes from day to night. You can carry it anytime. It's very, very durable. Um, so this would definitely be one that I could go to the office with it, leave, go out to dinner or what have you and fit in just perfectly. This is a very functional, functional bag. The next category is travel. And for travel, I would have to say, this one wins the prize for me. And this is my long shop bag. Um, I don't know what the model or whatever, but this is a bag that is also a workhorse. This bag has been traveled with me to many, many places. And the reason why I like this bag is obviously it's very, very lightweight. It folds up and everything. But when you're traveling on a plane and you have to put your handbag under the seat in front of you, this can ball up. It's, you know, um, fabric, so you don't have to worry about it scratching up. You can scrunch it under that seat in front of you, whatever you need to do and not be concerned about your handbag. What I would not want to do that with is my Chanel bag. So traveling on a plane with this, not gonna happen, not for me. So this type of bag for travel is perfect because you can throw it around and put it in different places. Sometimes you get on a plane and depending on where your seats are, you might have to put your handbag in the overhead and sometimes people come in, they put their... Okay, so those are my handbags for every occasion. I hope you've enjoyed watching them. Um, I look forward to hearing your comments and seeing your video that you might do on, on your handbags and how you use them. Um, I thank you for spending the time with me today. Uh, please subscribe to Sister Cousins and um, set your alert so that you are notified when we bring new uh, videos out to you. Uh, we do videos probably once or twice a week and we would love to have you as a part of our family. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.